The new year used to mean one thing for CrossFitters and that was open grip. But now with the sudden rise of popularity of the sport and the sudden influx of money, that means one thing. People are going to try and sell you shit that you don't need. Whether that's a workout program, whether that's a new knee sleeve or whether it's a nutrition program, it could be any of these things. But I'm sure you've all seen them in your Facebook news feeds, but they, they just won't fix the problem because they're selling a very superficial problem. Like you see it and you think, that's the thing I need to buy, that's the thing I need in my life that's going to help me. But it doesn't address a more systematic problem. And the problem used to be a lack of information, it's not that. And then it was like people didn't know how to apply this information, and, but you know that now. And then like the start with why the very popular book came out and people thought oh people don't understand their why but there's one more level that people aren't going to and that's who you believe yourself to be and this is a very difficult thing for a crossfitter to take like don't don't run away from this video now just because you've seen this and it might start to feel a bit uncomfortable for you to view this is the new area that you need to be attacking this is the real area that you need to be attacking because who you are and who you believe yourself to be is the reason you are where you are now. Like, you know the what. For example, like let's let's talk about mobility. You've got a lacrosse ball, you're smashing your quad, okay, that's the what. You're doing it in a very specific way and you're doing it maybe say twice a week or three times a week. That's your how you're applying that. And you know why you're doing it because you want to get stronger, it's going to allow you to squat more and all that kind of shit. So why the fuck are you doing it three days later or a week later? That's the big issue. So you know the what, you know the how and you know the why. Um, but it's this chatter inside your head that stops you doing it. And that is the constant thing, like I used to get this the whole time. And in fact, I still get it and I still hear it occasionally. But knowing that it's not true is the key. So you hear things like, I'm not good enough, or I don't have the time, or I don't have the money, or I don't know what I'm doing, and it's all this doubt in your head, and we hear it the whole time. But in order to become a better crossfitter, you need to know one thing, that that is based on complete bullshit. There's no evidence there, or at least there's no relevant evidence there. It might have come from something, like let's take the I'm lazy one. People tell themselves they're lazy the whole time, and they're so fucking mean to themselves. So you get this I'm lazy thing in your head, you play it over and over and over again, so you start believing it. And because you believe it, you start acting upon that belief and it's not true. But I've already told you the solution. The solution to the issue that you have isn't a new what, it's not a new program, it's not a like any of these things that I've said before. It's understanding who you are and it's listening to those beliefs and understanding that they're complete bullshit and they're founded on evidence that's not even slightly true or at least it's not true anymore. It may have been true at one point, but you as an athlete are full of potential. You have like all the advantages going for you if you can only get away from what's holding you back in here. And that is the truth of it. So what I'm gonna do is on Thursday, I'm gonna reveal some of the truth. I'm gonna do like a part two. Like I'm gonna show you the, the methods that you can use to start to tap into what is going on in your mind and what you can do about it basically because that is the only thing i promise you that's the only thing holding you back that's the thing that's stopping you from doing your mobility it's the thing that's stopping you from training as hard as you could do this or from like lacking that intensity or um, not prepping your food on time the thing that's holding you back isn't a lack of information it's what's going on up here so with that i'll hopefully see you thursday if you want to be introduce that when it goes live just shoot me a private message or like or comment on this post uh, maybe even share it if you want other people to hear it but that is that this day and i'll see you then this has been tom boxley